most of us are used to thinking of wool in terms of sweaters, wool is made into yarn, and yarn is knitted into pullovers, sports sweaters, and sometimes jackets, skirts, or dresses. But if you can't knit, or don't want to knit, don't despair, knitting isn't the only way to use wool. Indeed. There are several excellent fabrics which can be used in regular swing. One of the most familiar wool fabrics is felt, another is flannel. Other kinds of wool fabric include wool jersey and other tight knits, gabardine, chalice, tweed, and boku. Note that not all of these fabrics are always made from wool, gabardine, for example, can sometimes be made out of cotton. However, wool versions of each do exist. For the most part, you work with wool fabric much as you would with any fabric. Even knit fabrics, when made with wool, have very little stretch to them, so cutting isn't a problem. It's probably a good idea to use a server or a swing machine with a zigzag feature, to make sure that you bind the ends off properly, but not much more than with any other fabric, and it's certainly less important than some others. The biggest difference comes with actually washing the fabric, since most wool fabrics still can't be washed in the washing machine. Like other fabrics, unless you plan on consistently dry cleaning your garment, the wool fabric should be washed before you even begin to cut out your pattern. Use cold water, never hot, and mild detergent with absolutely no bleach to be had anywhere in it. Swish the wool fabric gently through the water to remove any dirt or impurities that may have accumulated, and to ensure that the fabric does any stretching or shrinking before you actually start to cut, rather than after. To dry the wool fabric, lay it nice and flat. Never hang it, since this could cause it to stretch out. For more such educational content, subscribe to Vishnu Consultants.